Bird flu restrictions are set to be eased across the UK, allowing for poultry and captive birds to be kept outside, giving them more space to roam about, and will give visitors greater access to the animals in farms open to the public. But experts say the virus is still posing a huge threat to wild birds. Sheffield farmer Rachel Gilbert says despite the financial difficulties they faced, the farm managed to remain biosecure, but bird flu will likely be a problem every year. So we have to go by what DEFRA outlines. So I think it was in November last year they said that all birds had to be kept undercover and anyone going in the bird area had to go through a foot bath and make sure they were sort of biosecure. So we've had to house all our birds inside an aviary over, it's been about six months actually, it's been quite a long time. Um, and although we've been capable of doing it, it's, it's quite tricky in terms of welfare to keep the standards that we would normally have. Um, obviously a smaller space needs lots more cleaning out, which means lots more using of bedding. Um, the indoor spaces are falling down because we've, we're a charity and we're struggling to find the finances to maintain them. Um, obviously we can't maintain them when the birds are in there, so it has been a bit of a challenge. Um, we are hoping to redevelop our aviary, but the problem is we, we expect bird flu to be a problem every year. The animals on the farm don't raise money in themselves, but a lot of the groups that come to the farm wouldn't be here without the animals. So some of the money that we get from each department will hopefully start going into the animals. Free range poultry was ordered to be brought inside in England, Wales and Northern Ireland to avoid birds coming into contact with wild birds. Yeah, the more people can donate, the better. I know it's a really hard time of year for a lot of people. But we have got a, a wish list online so people can buy us things that saves us obviously having to expend um, and yeah just donating what they can. Last year saw so the biggest outbreak of bird flu across the UK and the world affecting hundreds of farms around the country leading to four million birds being culled last year. However the threat has now been deemed low enough for farmers to keep their, to keep their poultry birds outside again. However, they would need to adhere to strict biosecurity measures, keeping their poultry birds away from wild birds or any areas where they may congregate. Paul Oluwadare, Just News, Sheffield.